Hey man, so Karina mentioned uh, that we could work on your deadlift, and the main thing that stood out to me is actually the same thing which I screwed up, which is uh, rushing the pull, not being patient enough. So you do, you do a great job of uh, maybe you could externally rotate more, that's, I'm not too concerned about that. Uh, you do a 99% great job of setting up the pull. You know, you're nice and open, hands are underneath your shoulders, your lats are tight, that's all great. I think you should do what I do, which is separate the pull into two motions. And that is, so you grab the bar, whatever, and then we both tend to get our air, and then I do the same thing with you, which is I rush it, I go, like I, I just do everything at once. Whereas I think what will help you, what's helped me, is I get my air, I pull up, there's this distinct movement, that'll be the first part, it's our getting in the air, pulling up, and then the second movement is gonna be dropping the hips. And when I'm dropping the hips, what's happening is, I'm not passively just sitting back. I'm thinking of curling my hamstrings while maintaining that upper body position. So my upper body is going from here to here, not by dropping my hips, but by curling my hamstrings, right? So it's air, brace air, pulling up this motion, and then using your hamstrings to sit down. I'll show you what that looks like from the side. There we go. Okay, so same thing. Side our feet, we're good. Reach the bar. So we're gonna brace, get our air. That motion, that pulling up, and then curling with the hamstrings to sit down. And the bar is gonna come up from that motion of, it's not gonna be from this pulling up, it's going to be from that curling of the hamstrings and putting your lats down, right? So, brace, inhale, pull up. And then my lats are going to go down. I'm going to show off my chest as I curl. So again, you're doing everything 90% right, it's just going to be about slowing it down into those two motions. I'll, uh, I'll link you a couple Instagram videos in one where you can see me slowing it down into those two motions. And I think that'll keep your back from losing position at heavier loads, your hips from coming up a bit at heavier loads. You just got to learn to be patient. That's, that's all it is.